Bounds. So the basis of the Philippines' claim over the spot list is through the discovery of Thomas Loma and by reason of uh, the occupation. The occupation doon natin yung pagpadala ni Marcos ng mga troops over those islands located or situated in the Kalayaan group of islands. But never did it mention about ownership. Wala term, even if you look at that, the discussion, wala, no, never did the concept of ownership was being mentioned. It was being mentioned. Even, no, even the union ruling, if you're going to read the union ruling, it does not also mention ownership. But what, what, what does it only mention is the jurisdiction. Kaya nga, artists, alam natin anong kaibahan ng ownership ng jurisdiction. Kasi ang question doon eh, what if ngayon, kasi sa under the regalian doctrine, under the use regalian doctrine, the onlands of the public domain, minerals, and all others, and all other natural resources are owned by the state. So what will happen now, let's say for example, in, in the island occupied by China, which is supposedly part of the strategic group of islands, in which the Philippines are sovereignty or jurisdiction, which is now being part of the national territory of the Republic of the Philippines. It just what happened that in uh, Chinese scientific digging or scientific, scientific investigation, they discovered mineral oils. Ang tanong doon, who will now own the mineral oils na nakuha ng China? 